Sometimes unforeseen circumstances arise after parties have entered into a contract. In such a case, the parties may need to modify their original agreement. Does that modification have to be supported by consideration to be valid? We explore that question in Gross Valentino Printing Company v. Clark. Frederick Clark published a magazine. He entered into a contract with Gross Valentino Printing to print the magazine. Gross originally quoted Clark $6,695 for the printing. Clark accepted the terms. Thereafter, Gross advised Clark that the price had increased to $9,300. Clark didn't object at that time. He accepted the first delivery of the magazines, signed the purchase order reflecting the increased price, and paid Gross. When Gross completed the shipment of the magazines, however, Clark stated that he wouldn't accept the new price. Gross filed suit against Clark in Illinois State Court for breach of contract. Clark asserted lack of consideration, fraud, and business compulsion as affirmative defenses. The trial court granted Gross's motion for summary judgment. Clark appealed to the Illinois Appellate Court.